Hi everyone, welcome to How Fix It. In this video guide, I'll show you how to replace the screen on the Apple Watch. To disassemble the Apple Watch, you'll need the following tools. Plastic opening tools, tweezers, glue. I will use B7000 glue due to its high elasticity, anti-vibration, and water-resistant properties. Screen disassembly tool. This tool has a very thin curved metal blade for opening electronic devices with a screen that is difficult to pry with a common plastic tool. I think this is a must-have tool for disassembling all Apple Watch series, because the gap between the screen and the watch body is so thin. During the display opening process of the Apple Watch, you might damage the force touch gasket. If you separate the gasket layers or cut the cable, you'll also need to replace the force touch cable itself. But don't worry, this cable costs around $5 and is easy to replace if damaged. Before you start, turn off the Apple Watch. If your touchscreen is broken and you can't turn off the watch, press and hold both the side button and digital crown simultaneously. Continue holding while the Apple Watch reboots. When you see the Apple logo, release the digital crown and continue holding the side button until the Apple logo disappears. For a more successful opening of the watch case, warm up the surface of the display with a regular hair dryer. Insert the edge of the curved blade into the thin gap between the display and the watch case. From this position, gradually begin to separate the display. Removing the cracked screen, don't forget to wear eye protection. To avoid damaging internal components, try not to push the blade deep inside the watch. Carefully fold the screen to the back. Now using tweezers, carefully peel off the black tape covering the three display ribbon cables. Use a plastic tool to open the locking tabs on the display. Now, carefully pull the display ribbon cables out of their connectors. If the force touch gasket is damaged, remove the remaining layers from the display frame and the watch housing. Now, let's install the new screen and test it. In the description, I left a link where to buy the screen for the Apple Watch. It looks like the watch is working fine. Now you can proceed to the final part of the assembly. Let's move on to gluing the display with the housing. This will restore protection from water and dust. You can use a special adhesive sticker for your Apple Watch or silicone glue. In my opinion, for protection against water and dust, glue is more effective.
To fix the display and the main housing, you can use clips or rubber bands. The B7000 glue dries completely after 24 hours, but the minimum surface drying time is 6 minutes. So I recommend waiting at least 45 minutes, after which you can remove excess glue. This repair is complete. You're on how fix it, and see you next time.